And joining us live now via Skype is Hurricane Hunter Lieutenant Colonel John Talbot. And John, what are you seeing out there now? Do you have any reports from the Hurricane Hunters that are investigating it right now? Yeah, good morning, Alex. Um, yeah, the airplane uh, during the during during the night up until this morning has seen a, a sheared tropical cyclone, um, 30 to uh, 50 mile an hour winds, and uh, basically, I'm I'm going to say a, a fairly benign flight. Um, so we haven't seen a whole lot of strengthening as you've seen in the in the forecast and all the discussions. Right, we've been looking at the satellite and it doesn't look too great. Now, what is the plan as far as the day ahead? Will you send out more flights? Are you going to be uh, keeping the same flight out there? Um, yeah, we'll have another aircraft that will depart uh, Keesler Air Force Base in several hours, and it'll go out and spend most of this afternoon in the storm. It'll be out there until early evening, and um, it'll uh, do that mission, and then it'll head over to the Houston area where we're going to evacuate all our aircraft to, so, to protect the assets. Now, you mentioned it's a pretty benign storm at this point. Anything interesting that the hunters have, have found in investigating Karen? Well, actually, yesterday, uh, the first flight in the morning uh, found some uh, pretty good winds. You know, as you saw, 65-mile-an-hour winds at the altitude the airplane was at, and uh, that was under all that convection that was out there at that time. So um, as the convection has sort of waned and, and been sheared off to the east, uh, the winds have sort of done the same thing.